my god, it's been a while. <laughs> Hello, Void Dweller T, Mystery Theater, uh, Doors. Oh my god, you guys chat a lot there. Zarmegas. Oh my god, welcome everybody. Back to Trails in the Scales. Last time, the mayor was the enemy. Ha <laughs> ha, I did it all myself and with my beasties. I was the one who burned down the orphanage. Yes, it was Yakuza 3 all over again. <laughs> Only this time, as before, we have somebody going around hypnotizing people into being evil. And, uh, or whatever. I'm very curious to see how this is going to work out. Because, is, I guess, the, I've heard that one thing I did hear about this game is, uh that the first and second Trails games were originally supposed to be one game. Uh, but uh, they split it into two for budget reasons, I think. So what what I think is probably going to happen is that at the end of this game, once we do what we need to do in Grand Soul, probably, because I, I can't imagine that we're not going to see gr the all the regions uh, that in, in, this, in this version, in this part of the game. Uh, the mas the mastermind will be revealed and get away, and you know that's what I think. Then it'll be to be continued in Trails in the Sky SC, and uh, that's pretty much how I think it's gonna end. I do wonder. Um, oh, hello, hello, Mirage. Welcome to the stream. <laughs> uh, the uh, yes, the true villain is Harry the Hypnotist. <laughs> Oh my god, so I have no idea who the villain is. I really hope it's not Olivier, because he's totally cool, and I really don't want him to be a bad guy. And, uh, but yeah, I can't think of any random NPCs that we've met. You know, it'd be crazy. It'd be absolutely fucking nuts if it was Cassius Brad. <laughs> That's right, I was evil all along. My secret mission was to get everyone to turn evil. <laughs> but, uh, probably not, I'm guessing. Okay, but that would be a crazy plot twist. Especially since, um... <sighs> really, Aeonium? By the way, welcome to the stream. Welcome, Aeonium and Fodder, to the stream. So, what we're gonna do now is we just saved at the chapter 2 end. And uh, I've heard we can buy one more. Oh, cutscene. <sighs> oh, the hypnotizing dudes. Stubborn bastard. Hey, 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 hey. I don't know what's keeping up with the. What's wrong? It's going too fast. I can't. <laughs> we can't shake him. We have no choice. Time to counterattack. I guess you're finally taking me seriously. <laughs> Good. I was getting sick of playing tag with you fools. He's not gonna give up until he's dead! What a stubborn idiot. Does he really think he can beat 21? <laughs> seriously, dude! You're just literally generic mook society! He's like... I... He's, he has, he's a 90s guy with spiky hair and, a, and, a, and like a freaking giant ass... Buster Sword knockoff. There is no way in hell you guys have a chance. <laughs> <laughs> I think I already have. What? Every foot takes spirit. You lose that, you lost everything. Until I figured out exactly what kind of spirit you losers had when you took off with your tails between your legs. Silence, Gilder Dog! We can handle you. Here for a painful death. Keep thinking that. Uh, how could this possibly have been foreseeable? Damn it! We can't get caught now. Huh. Okay. How about you just surrender and give me your full confessions? Starting with you, who you are and what you're after. You needn't concern yourself about that. Are we finally going to meet the mastermind? What? Oh, he's wearing a mask. 
I wonder if it's the evil looking like guy who's probably Joshua's brother who looks like an older Joshua with white hair under that mask. When did you get here? C -c -c Commander! This guy was picking on us. You came for us. Oh. Oh, yeah, it's this dude. You two are pitiful. You failed to report in as appointed. And this is why. Ooh, we have no excuses. Oh. Chai, stop. It's here. Oh, God. Sorry, cat's in a mood. We've had a lot of interference. I get it. So you're the man in charge. <laughs> Only of this particular sea. Allow me to apologize on behalf of my men. Could I persuade you to overlook this incident? Huh? Okay, repeat that. I said that I'd like for you to overlook this incident. We never had any intention of running afoul of the brace again. Don't make me laugh. You think I'm just gonna look the other way and let you get away with it? You did? Ah, oh, well. I thought that a generous offer, personally, certainly a fairer price than death. Both of you, stand down. Return to the rendezvous point at once. Yes, sir! Thank you, Commander! Where do you think you're going? Oh, no, I'm afraid you won't be going anywhere, sir. Son of a... <laughs> Fine. The target may have changed but as long as they have one. And you being the leader, I assume, you got a lot better information to offer me than your underlings anyway. <laughs> you would think it'll be that easy to make me talk. I sure as hell intend to find out! Ah! <laughs> Chibi action! Let's go, Chibi fight! <laughs> Not bad. Not bad at all. You have an irrepressible passion. But a great weight bears down upon you. You are not quite so different from me. Uh, what did you just say? It's a painful thing to be powerless in a time of crisis. But you know that feeling all too well. No. I can see it in your eyes. <laughs> Fine, then. I don't know who you are, but I think I like you. There is no shame in power. There is no shame in being outmatched. You and I both know that. I wonder if he's a veteran of the war? I wonder. Like, basically, a people, like, a group that kind of went too far in deciding that Liberal would never be too weak to fight on their own ever again. <sighs> That's just my theory, anyway. Perhaps we could come to a mutually beneficial agreement. Screw you! <laughs> don't act like you don't know- Don't act like you know anything about me! You're in for one hell of a beatdown! <laughs> oh damn, he actually won. I wasn't expecting that. <laughs> All talk, no shock. Damn, Agate, have you been taking tips from Estelle lately? <laughs> oh my god! But the guild's gonna love interrogating you. Surprise. What the? Is that... 
The body split craft? Oh, is he gonna nothing personnel kid on? Can him? Oh boy. I could sense something faint from the dark forest beyond. <laughs> nice try. But you've got a heavy heart. And a heavy heart makes for a light blade. Why don't you come out from hiding and say that? When a warrior enters a skirmish, he must be prepared to lose everything. Otherwise, he can gain nothing. In order to live as a man, he must forgo all anger and grief. Body split craft is just Shadow Clan Jutsu. Thanks, Hell Mirage. Oh, hello, Stanley. Welcome to the stream. With that, I bid you farewell. The presence in the trees seem to have vanished. Uh, for go? How the hell am I supposed to do that? Ah! Well, that was a pretty cool scene. Chapter 3, The Black Ornament. Ooh, The Black Materia. Here we go. Legend of Heroes, Trails in the Scales. Do, 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 neat, do. What a scene. Meanwhile, in ruin. Guess she's not here yet. Did we get that here that early? Could be. Wanna kill some time at the tavern? Oh, damn, Stell, I think you're gonna say yes. Nah, it's Nick Stell. I think I'd rather just wait here. I doubt I could ever get tired of the view of the river. Yeah, no kidding. I even get the feeling that ruin's finally back to normal. Pretty amazing, considering the uproar after Mayor Dalmore's arrest. Well, a seated mayor has never been arrested before. I would imagine if Mayor Klaus was arresting Roland. Yeah, that would be a real shock. And when I think of it that way, the people of Ruin almost seem cold. I mean, they were clearly surprised by what happened. But not a single person was truly shocked, as far as I can tell. Well, you have to remember, the Mayor of Ruin has always been selected by Bloodline alone. So yeah, they're not really the mayor. They're just the mayor in terms of title. He wasn't elected to his position by the Rainians. And that probably makes all the difference in the world. Yeah, that's true. People of Roland appointed Klaus mayor because they liked him and trusted him. Dalmore is getting what he deserves. I still feel kind of bad for him. Estelle literally burned down an orphanage. Oh, yeah, that's right. Hey, look who's here. Huh? Oh, Sig! Oh, hello! Estelle, Joshua! Hey! I'm sorry that I'm late. No problem, we just go here ourselves. Don't tell us you ran all the way here. You really didn't need to rush. I couldn't let you two go without seeing you all. Thank you so very much for contacting me. Chloe, I keep telling you, you don't have to thank us. You too, see. Thanks for coming. No problem. <laughs> Well, then shall we be off? What happened to my mouse? Okay. We need to use the south exit to reach Zeiss, right? Yes. On the southern road is a checkpoint called Air Letton. They were already there for side quest. You can set out the Zeiss from there. Roger that. Okay, let's go! Rock! <laughs> 
Yeah, let's go. Ah! Sorry about that. Sieg sometimes thinks he's a parrot, even though he's an eagle. <laughs> That's okay. All right, but before we do that, let's um, let's talk to everybody in town. I never suspected Mayor Talmore of such crimes. Especially the mayor and ruin has been held by the Talmores for generations. By the Talmore family for generations! Ho ho! I suspect one of them being arrested will be under that little tradition. An old man like me has been a genuine shock. Alright. Yep, there's the news. We need more revival jams. <laughs> All right. Uh, yeah, let's read that before we forget to do it. Breaking story! Ruin Mayor arrested! A sudden arrest! Yesterday afternoon, Ruin's Mayor Morris Dalmo, age 48, was arrested by the Royal Guard on suspicion of arson and intent to commit other crimes. His steward, Gilbert Stein, 25, was arrested on the same charges. Both are in the custody of the Intelligence Division and have been transferred to Layston Fortress. A horrifying rampage by the incumbent mayor! Mayor Dalmore is suspected of ordering the arson carried on the Mercia Orphanage and plotting the theft of the dono donations as well. Look at that. Look at that picture of him. He's going, Rawr! I, I be evil now, so I'll use an evil picture of me. Ha ha! Although those responsible for committing the acts have not yet been caught, Mayor Stuart Gilbert was seized at the scene suggesting his involvement. Our sale aids in arrest. Mayor Dalmore abruptly fled its its residence during questioning by the Bracer Guild, attempted to free, flee down the Rubine River in his personal yacht. The Bracers reacted quickly and alerted the Royal Guard, who rushed to the scene in the high-speed cruiser at our sail and used its hull as a barrier to thwart the escape. After his apprehension, the subject subsequently a temporary lapse of memory, possibly due to shock, but has since regained his composure. What motivated such a despicable act? figure pointed to privilege and wealth, who for years managed the affairs of the municipal government, has fallen from grace, all for what in the end was nothing more than an enormous debt, for, born from insatiable personal greed. <laughs> Dang. So people in our world don't even need to be hypnotized to do that. <laughs> in an in investigation conducted by the LeBron News, it was uncovered that Morris Dalmore had been engaged in a number of speculative market transactions. However, a year prior, those deals in the Republic fell through and was left with a substantial debt. In order to recover his losses, Dalmore diverted memory money from the city's budget. Oh, wow, dang. <laughs> Attempted to develop a number of resort homes to be built somewhere within the region. His reasoning that the profit gain from some prime real estate would hide his pilfering from the city coffers as a result. Oh, God. Did he do that before or after he was hypnotized? Jeez. Unfortunately, the key to his plan, the Mercia Orphanage, declined an offer to sell the land upon which it stood. <laughs> the desperate suspect then resorted to arson and slipped into the a heinous spree of crime. Society ruined and rates a speedy election. With the incumbent mayor under arrest and capable of fulfilling his duties, Ruin succeeding municipal government is expected to endure an extended period of confusion. However, though the through the embolishment of the aristocracy and simultaneous enactment of a royal charter, in an instance such as this one, the law stipulates that an election must be held at the earliest possible date and a new mayor selected. Therefore, in the interest of public stability, a prompt and non-partisan election is awaited by all. Also, we await flying cars and trip to the moon. Technology. Technology. The org of Orville Calcula Calculator. Capital. Ca Wait, with the Orville Calculator, Capital number one in processing the worldwide. 
mechanical computation through the application of ordnance has been used in a various vast range of fields beginning with navigational equipment aboard airships. However, the capital, which is located in the Zeiss Central Factory, reigns supreme in this department. The capital has the ability to instantly locate information within its databanks. Oh, they're inventing computers before TV! Wow! This is an interesting little progression of technology here. They're inventing computers before they even have TVs. It's currently stored. I'm not equal to that numerous encyclopedias. Its inventor, Professor Russell, is presently researching further possible applications for this technology. City sure is noisy. It's something major happening, I wonder. Let's check out the cafe. You have anything we don't have? No. Nope. You know what? This heals from KO. I'm going to get a bunch of it. There. Looks like you got the whole maintenance kit thing sorted out. How's the old salt doing? He seemed to be just fine. He sends his regards. Does he now? Good, good. He'd eventually get the best of us all. Sounds like he's uh, still hanging in there. I really appreciate it. Good luck out there. Thanks. See you later! They put so much love into the like this game, like with all the NPC conversations. Like, imagine writing all that, like changing words for everybody in every town. Before and after major events. Hard to believe the mayor's been arrested. I suppose that means we'll be electing a new mayor. I'm extreme I'll be extremely interested in seeing who decides to run for office. Same. Oh, I didn't even see there was a dude there. Haha, <laughs> I did it! I figured out the map! Okay, this time I'm gonna just find that pirate treasure. Keep on, don't let your dreams be memes, dude. Keep on keeping on. I do hope that the camera for the map is something that's fixed in later games, though. Like, I, I don't like I don't like how they do the manual camera. Although it's probably just in my keyboard controls, it'd probably be much more comfortable with a second joystick. But I really appreciate it going to default north all the time. The mayor did something bad. He's not a nice man. Oh, poor baby. Is it true? What the liberal news wrote? You just want to believe that the mayor was a criminal. And so I never really liked him that much. I think I'll go search for some fishing next. Never there poor. Here it's a fisherman's dream. It's so weird, we barely have anything to do in the Orgman Factory. Because we've unlocked everyone's slots. Oh, thank God, Chloe's still in the party. I hope we get to keep Chloe. Please, for the love of God, don't, don't make me get rid of Chloe. Seriously, game, I am begging you.
I'm relieved to know that the mayor's been arrested. Since House Dalmore has no more heirs, we'll have to elect a new mayor, won't we? I think this is as good a time as any to stop the whole hereditary mayor thing, dude, so. That's nice. Oh, damn. God. Uh. Oh, no. I forgot there's this whole under... underbelly here. Oh, no. Am I... Oh, good, good, good. I can get out there. Woo! Oh, yeah. Let's check out the landing port. I know there's a couple of NPCs here. Again, I really wish that each map would default to facing north. All he's talking to the mayor doing these terrible things is quite unsettling. Even though it's a good thing that he was arrested. Something, someone like that, no doubt, will get into, only get into more trouble if you're allowed to run free. The British are guilty to be commended. <laughs> oh yeah, the, the delinquents. Let's see if they're still in their uh, hideaways here. Although I forgot exactly where that is. Well, there's a dude over there, regardless. Oh. Not for me. My brother probably be researching new kinds of engines. I've been invited to Zeiss as a guest engineer. In the end, it didn't even matter. I turned down the invitation. It's very flattering to me as an engineer, but I'm Todd's brother first and foremost. Oh, we have a little family drama going on with these two. I have my own reasons for not wanting to leave Ruin. I think, in general, blenders are, are the, around the same price point dollar. But yeah, you know, Vitamix or Blendtec should be the kind if you really want an actual blender that will not leave chunks in whatever you're blending. We care about each other, so we try to take care of each other. It's not always easy, that's for sure. That's definitely true. Dangerous combustible object primitive, the Royal Warship Orb Ship Co. That's all we can see here for now. Let's have a... Oh, wait. Is this... No, no, that's where we started. I believe we're at the, the top half of Ruin right here. Okay, let's see what... Uh, how's everybody doing in the church? It's heartbreaking that the children should be drawn into such terrible events. The head of our church is planning to visit the children. I intend to go with him, if you allow me. Well, I hope he does. So the love of money claimed the mayor. As it has done with so many others. Care must be taken to ensure the region does not fall into chaos and disorder. Almighty Artios, please grant us your guidance and wisdom. Let's raid people's homes. This whole mess with the mayor has caused quite a stir. It's making it difficult to study what with all the noise. It's just amazing to, to, to me that the mayor Dalmo was all uh, responsible for all the trouble. I always thought he was a good boy, man. Boy, was I wrong. You only have a bed for one person here in the three people. Look at this pathetic excuse for an upstairs. I wonder what our dads were making so much noise about. Given that the mayor was the fate of ruins, tourism industry, the rest will really ruin the town's image. <laughs> ruin. Jeez. Haha. <laughs> yes, I suppose we should have seen that one coming with naming our town Ruin. We've already seen a drop in the number of visitors and hotel reservations. People keep saying, don't go to ruin or your vacation will be ruined. 
And that is the worst tagline ever. ever. We really should change the name of the town. If you really have to elect a new mayor, I'd prefer it to be Mr. Norman. I think he'd do a lot to help build up the tourism industry. I'm sure you will. Let's check the weapon shop. Huh, Mayor Dalmore. He was always one to put on his. But never in a million years did I think he'd put him on that thick. <laughs> There's some thick ass airs. Let's see if there's any more weapons. Nope. Okay. Oh yeah, no, no, no. Ninja Blunders is not gonna do do what you need. That's for just processing vegetables. To to blend a smoothie, a Ninja Blender will not do it. If you've got a smile on your face all your life, it kind of loses its meaning. But the fact is, we're alive. Yes, life needs things to live. Hotel Blanche. The rest of the mayor is going to cause some big trouble for government proceedings. It'll also have a big impact on tourism. Everyone's vacation will be ruined. Changes. Mayor getting arrested doesn't matter. I'm always still working. Nobody ever gives a damn about old Murray anymore. I don't know what's going on right now. No point getting all worked up over it though. Check out the school as well. And we'll go back and do the bottom part of the town earlier, but yeah, let's uh, check out the school. Too bad there's no fast travel in this game. I kind of wish there was. Although, only in the within each region. God damn it, Chloe. You sure have to walk a long ass way through monster filled woods to get to your freaking school. I know it is rather troublesome. I hope, I wish they would install a better road. Well, maybe you should bring that up with the principal. Gym class just finished up! You need more than studying to succeed in life. It also takes physical fitness! A beautiful body comes with a beautiful mind. I never saw that movie. A few of my classes will put you on the right track for that. I auditioned, I gave my script in, but they rejected it. Those Hollywood bastards! They said I'll be mistaken for porn. Well, I guess that title does kind of lend itself to not over mind. One more day finished. So what to do next? Checking out the school. Oh, hello. Hello, Reina. 
Oh, well, hey, everybody forgets a few things from time to time. Oh, a scene. Haha, <laughs> if you don't hurry, activity time will be over. I'm working on our class assignments. Just came back here to get some supplies, you see. Not that we forgot them. We, uh, just needed more. Yeah, totally. <laughs> Shut up. Okay, nothing here. Checking on NPC conversation. <laughs> I wish evening would come sooner. I find the dark very soothing, so I really enjoy it. I just really like taking baths in absolute pitch black. That sounds kind of scary. You should try it if you get the chance. It's incredibly relaxing. I don't know, man. That sounds scary and kind of dangerous. In my experience, reviewing the class lesson really makes a difference. I review for three hours and do prep work for another two every day. Dang. Dedication. Plants are getting overgrown. I'll have to prune them back soon. Forget you, Mickey. Hey there, what can I do for you? We're good. Hey, Jill! Hey, Saul and Joshua. You guys come here especially to see me. It hasn't been so long. But there's been lots going on, both good and bad. It sure is good to see you, too. Once everything really settles down for good, we can all focus on our futures. I hope you have, you have fun when you go to Zeiss. Well, if it ain't Josh, one is still. Ha ha ha! I read in the liberal news about Mayor Dalmore and his dirty little schemes. Well, I guess that's why he acted all innocent and benevolent when he gave his donation at the festival. A rotten bastard. And he was even nasty enough to attack the matron afterwards. He must really be rotten to the core. He's definitely not hypnotized. Well, actually, I... It's okay, Estelle. Let's see. Maybe around here. I'm looking around for stuff to help me with the novel, I imagine. In the end, I dare say there will be a romantic scene. Oh, I can't say it. It's too... It's too embarrassing. In the end, the two lovers will hold hands. I dare say, I cannot mention it anymore, or my face will become a tomato. All the books I've been reading lately have really inspired me to write something of my own. Here, take a look at this one. I found a particularly good thing. God damn it, Cornelia. Reading is fun for the brain. Whatever you say, purity. Time for, time for club activities. If we rest, we'll lose our edge. Of course you have to have some rest, no matter how much you want to practice. Oh, okay, Patrick. God, I cannot do that voice for too long. Jeez. Oh, hello, Dumbledore. Ah, hello there. I've known Tom for so long that it's difficult to contain my shock at what he's been doing. It's not so much that his crimes are unforgivable, but I think he might be true. I pray that it will come to regret straying from the path.
I've been put in charge of writing up the entrance examinations for this year. Ha <laughs> ha! I look forward to the challenge. Oh, did you need me for something? Please, it's just ended. This should be on about in any moment. Mr. Ratio! Ha 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 ha! Classes may be over, but I still get questions from my students. I, like, didn't really understand the lessons in my last class, so, like, I totally need to ask the teacher. Okay, time for club activities. I got to finish this painting today. They cleaned up all the freaking science shit. Look at that molecule. Oh man, I wanted to ask Miss Melia about this stuff I didn't understand. But she always leaves the classroom in such a hurry. I never got the chance. Oh, all right, done with classes. Time to go for club activities. My club is the Helant Around Home Club, so I'm quite excited. I'll go back home to my island. With my huge family and the lovely maid that I'm going to marry, and totally nothing bad will happen. Yeah, good luck with that, dude. Miss Viola! Let's see the problem here. How do you do it? <laughs> oh, it's Monica. Here, Miss Viola. Right here's where I started to get lost. No. Like they appeared out of nowhere. I was like, what the heck? <laughs> Roy's our boy. Rumor has it the Queen's birthday celebration is going to feature in the biggest competition yet this year. Oh, that We're probably going to be entering that. I'd love for my fencing club to participate. <laughs> okay, archery breakers today. It's been a while since I've had a break from working on the festival. Oh, yes. Today's lesson was very worthwhile. Absolutely. Logically worthwhile. Okay, let's go. Here's the play. God, seriously. What a memorable scene. What a memorable scene. All right, bye school. I hope in future games we can come back here and do more school stuff. I loved this story arc so much. Right now we get to, uh, just see Minoria. Just going all over. Doesn't this sound like a Zelda song for the first, uh, for the first couple of notes? L let me make it play the first couple of notes again. It sounds like you're entering Hyrule Field. D doesn't that sound like the Hyrule Field theme? I really, I don't know. It just really stands like that to me. Oh, in the Cold Steel arc, it takes place out of school entirely? Is that why it's four games? Because it's like four years of a high school. That's actually an awesome idea for a game series, actually. Like, Persona, but literally all four years of the school. 
th that's really cool. I can't wait till I get to that in like 2030. <laughs> oh my god. Fucking hell! Run! Oh god damn it! Why do they even have it like this? Where you have to go like part of it to the beach for no reason? Seriously. I'm just trying to do fluff dialogue. You're gonna have to throw me off my groove, Mr. Game. Okay, let's see. Uh, nobody's here. My back's been feeling better ever since the children came. Maybe some of their energy is rubbing off on me. <laughs> the kids finally seem happy again. I'm having a tough time deal dealing with Mayor Darmore being a criminal. There's no telling what the kids will think once they figure it all out. God, I, I really want more heartwarming brother-sister scenes uh, with Estelle and Joshua. Like, that's the only good the only good thing about the people leaving our party is that we just get, like, the heartwarming brother-sister moments between the two. That, that makes this game so unique. Like, y'all know how much I love romance, but, like... This is like, this is something just sweet on its own. Just some family stuff. And that's really adorable. All right, time to get back to climbing. Beats of Crow not calling to me. Oh, you're the side quest dude that we helped out. Huh. You have much snow left on the south face for it to be safe. I just have to plan a new route. Good job looking out for your dad. I'm not surprised that Stuart Gilbert is a criminal. But even so, it's hard to believe that the mayor would be involved in something that terrible. I guess he'll have the rest of his life to pay for what he's done. I asked everyone from the orphanage to stay here until they can rebuild. We've had a good bit of fun. That's lovely. Uh, nobody's here. Uh, nobody's here either. She's done for us. Oh my, Estelle, are you leaving? Yeah, I've got to go to Zeiss actually. Oh, I see. I am all greatly indebted to you for all that you've done. It pains me that I can't repay your kindness like you deserve. Please, it's really fine. I'm really just glad that all those kids are happy again. Estelle, please be well and safe on your journey to Zeiss. Thank you, ma'am. I wish you all the best. On behalf of everyone, thank you. Aww. That was a lovely goodbye. What are we gonna have for snacks today? Um, one and two. 
it's no fun playing with Polly when Polly's it. Whatever you say, Tiny Tim. Let's see. Okay, anyone home? Yeah, you're home. Now, where'd Sakura off to this time? He's probably gone gaga. I was hoping to get, get him to go to ruin for me. All right, and that's it. Now, let's go uh, to the, to the uh, southern part of ruin. Uh, do everything there, and then it's off to Zeiss. Oh, wait, I think uh, we can actually see. Yeah, this one we're building over here. Oh, it's just like a warehouse. I can hear kids' voices from here. I just be praised. Uh oh, there's Zack. I'm in shock that the mayor was involved in those crimes. <laughs> well, at least the matron will get some kind of reparations or proof can be established. If your orphanage gets rebuilt, I'll be glad to help. God damn it, this isn't the place. I do wonder if Estelle or Joshua are gonna get like a love interest later on and like how that affects their relationship. Like, cause that seems like it's something ripe for character development. But I have a feeling a lot of stuff will have to do more with the. Uh, Rather than then going on a journey with Joshua's actual past. Like, I'm betting he's some kind of royalty from a foreign country. Down to the southern part. We never even saw the freaking guild. Where's the fucking guild? There's the hotel, Orville factory. Somehow we missed the guild before. Okay. Oh, hey you guys. Carta? <laughs> Are you feeling better? A fit is a fiddle. I'm back at work as of today. I wish I had some way to pay you back for all the trouble I put you through. Oh, come on! Once you give up, become full fledged bracers, come back to ruin. I'll be waiting for you. Hello? Oh, yeah, let's report. That's right. Oh, nothing to report. Hello, Jean! Woo! Are you planning to go to Zeiss next? There may be clues about the Black Omen there. There'll be a real load off my mind once you get promoted to, to get promoted to full price braces. Eugene, you gotta follow us! Eugene! The mirror's been arrested. I just don't. What's going on? <laughs> Now we can go to the southern part of the city. Was the man really arrested? I don't know the whole story, but it must have been something major. <laughs> oh, yes it was. Salubrious oatmeal. Which, oh, uh, should I return the fishing rod? Or should I keep it? The man arrested. Don't care how much money you got or who you are, you start attacking orphans, you're scum. It's a Nazi enough story to shock the foulest of the scoundrels. <laughs> oh, I did not check for new missions on the guild board. Let me go and do that after I clean out this building here. I'll be up at sea, so I won't get a chance to vote. 
But over the next memories, I hope to keep the talking and the sailors in mind. You gotta fill out an absentee ballot, dude. <sighs> the guys in the North Block want Norman to be the new mayor. We were reporters. Don't steal the fishing rod. Okay. Return progressive rod. Ah, thank you. So did the goddess smile upon your rod today. <laughs> Just let me know if you get hungry. I'll cook you the best meal you've ever had. <sighs> ah, it's you. I'm sorry for getting you so angry earlier. I didn't know the full story. Eric tells me that my, my topical gang her truly was the spitting image of him. It's a shame, really. If it caught him, I could have made him do all the work around here and no one be any the wiser. <laughs> Just kidding, of course. Look at all these barrels! Barrels everywhere! I don't care if they're made of metal, they're still fucking barrels. I don't know I took your reason me too seriously. I don't even never buy replacement for our equipment. A real man wouldn't do what best, would do best for us what he sits in. No one makes him the most money. It's supposed to select this man would make things a lot less stressful on us. I wonder in the next game are we gonna have a whole like election story arc in ruin? Thank you for your help earlier. Hopefully I can count on it if I get myself into a fix again. Looks like the ravens are coming back. Maybe just me, but they seem pretty out of sorts. Could just be the gravity of everything that happened, though. Alright, now let me go check the guild, Dad. That I've done the whole uh, sa sailors area. In the wrong place. Yep, nothing new. We did all the missions there. Okay. And no one except the Dalmors has ever been elected as mayor before. But the next election will change all of that. Unpleasant though it will be. I can guess if that anyone else wants to be mayor, now's the time to go after it. Oh yes, our Vegas. So glad that's caught the was in a new update. I was worried about him, but yeah, he's back. Woo! <laughs> I wish my husband had a little more drive. Wait, there's a second page? I didn't even know it could go to two pages. Wait, what, what, what? Aeonium? I've never, I didn't even know that two pages were possible. God damn it. The Dalmors have truly fallen far from their really ever hand of those crimes. It never seemed like a real mayor ever again. More importantly, I just worry about those poor kids from the orphanage. I can't do much of anything to help, but at least I can dote on them a little. They're all safe in Minoria. How do you get... Th there is no page two. At least none that I could see. Sorry, Ionium. So, yeah, I didn't see the page two. Let's check the mayor's house. How's he doing? Oh, the maids. I've gotten wrapped up in this whole mess. I think that Dario and I are going to leave soon and go find new jobs. Maybe I should become a guide. Who would have believed that the mayor would be arrested? What's to become of this estate now? It's okay, Aeonium. Don't worry about it. 
Hilarious, Sarvegas. Hilarious. Ha ha ha. Very funny. Diego, I always thought that the marriage would be a fine man, and I was proud to prepare his meals. We've come to a sorry state, more's the pity. Oh, that's my house. I've served House Dormal for over 30 years. That is a distinguished family. When the longest we have dedicated service to ruin should come to this. Oh wow, I, do, I, I forgot to check that out. Let me see. He matches the mirror's room. A tropic control unit here. Oh yeah, this is a secret escape tunnel. That's right. Okay. All right, now let's go check the rest of Southern Ruin, and then we can at last be on our way to Zion's. Of course, Hollow Mirage, page 256. How could I have possibly forgotten? Oh, there's a dude there. Gartner the Gartner. I have been working here for a long time, but what should I do about my pay? Grab everything you can that's not bolted down. <laughs> This dude is a criminal, no one is gonna blame you. My brother hasn't come home yet, and my dad said he's not welcome here. Ooh, what is this drama? How come my dad's always so cold to my big brother? I'm in shock that the mayor was involved in such a horrible scandal. I thought him to be such a fine man when I spoke to him. What's happened is truly a shame, but we can't afford to sit and puzzle over it. God damn it, Boy Jelly, you're never gonna let go of the thing about the IPDs, are you? <laughs> the IPDs didn't have unique dialogue, they were literally just generic lines that you had to find a match to. These are all like unique hand written dialogue for each NPC at specific times in the game. It is not comparable. <laughs> oh God, it was an RNG, it was an RNG based thing in uh, Archinelico. And uh, let me tell you, I did every side quest except that in Archinelico. I got every motherfucking shop event. Every fucking one and every freaking conversation possible for all the shopkeepers. I believe I did my fair share of side quests for, for Archinelico. <laughs> like, there's no value in doing the IPDs unless you really need the whatever little bonus they gave you. And I was able to beat the game easily without them. So it was, it's fine. The man made a great mistake, but he's the reason the ruins have been so successful in expansion. Huh. Oh wait, is, is the brother that dude that helped the mayor? I, I wonder if he was also hypnotized. Here's where the uh, delinquents. There they are. I could have sworn that Gilbert was coming here. Can't remember a damn thing about this whole to do. Oh, you guys were. Yeah, that's right. You guys were hypnotized. Huh. No need to get all pissy about it. Not like the soldier shake isn't already riding my ass. Dude, you should consider yourself lucky. I guess it's my famous luck with women at work again. 
Oh, I don't want a soldier chick to ride my ass. <laughs> Just for two screw of us. I'd say you're in an enviable position. If they spot you, you'll get locked up in the naval airship. The girl in a blue and white uniform told me so. Can't believe we got control with a mirror like that. All those things he made us do like friggin' puppets. Rawr! Like him of all people. Pathetic as that. <sighs> if Aggie finds out about this, he's gonna start hitting us again. I don't think my head can take any more trauma. Hey, Jabu Jabu. Looks like the mirror was nastier than any of us. Oh, gee, whoa! See this cut? This is from Agate Sword. Right, challenge this chick with a military haircut to a duel. You should have seen it. She beat him down so fast, he barely knew what hit him. He was like, oh, this is so hot, but it hurts. Oh, oh, oh. We've seen a lot of cute chicks lately, but they all have to be such badasses. Dude. Dude, you guys are lucky as hell. Who is this lady? How soon can I meet her? She's probably someone I've seen. Jeez. Gilbert was taken away in a different airship from us. I wonder where they're taking him. Oh yeah, we already talked to you. Okay, so, um... I believe we are done with, uh, Ruin. So yeah, let's go to the, no let's go to the checkpoint. Bye-bye, Ruin. It was nice knowing you. What a lovely seaside town. Oh god, the fucking cassowaries are here. Back to the lovely Erlutton waterfall here. I've been here before, but this is a nice little spot. I can hear it's breathtaking. It certainly doesn't feel like a checkpoint, that's for sure. Actually, I hear there are a lot of visitors come here to see the waterfall. Really? Ruin sure has a lot of nice places, huh? I can understand why the Duke would want to live here. Agreed. But I think Roland is also a nice relaxing place to live. Oh! You've been to Roland? Yes, I've been to all five of the great cities. Oh, that's right. Zeiss is up ahead. You'd be surprised how charming it is. Uh, really? Sounds like we're in for some fun! Alright, why don't we get the paperwork started then? Okay. Anything special to do here? Let's check it out. Oh, sounds like we're into, in for some combat dungeons. Very soon. <laughs> hey, welcome to the Urlet and Checkpoint. When again, set up, go through, into the counter inside.
Good afternoon. How may I be of assistance? We're wondering what had to be done to obtain permission to enter Zeiss. Huh, okay then. Step right up, I'll take care of you. Be aware though, once these procedures have begun, you will not be allowed to leave the checkpoint. You're okay with that? Yeah, go ahead, please. And please start by signing these documents here, here, and here. Chloe, I really hope you stay with us. Tell the doctor to sign their names and documents. All right, everything looks to be in order. Young lady, they're not joining you. Oh, I only came to see them all. God damn it! <laughs> oh, very well, then. I'll be able to accompany them as far as the mouth of the Caldia Tunnel. Thank you very much. What's the Caldia Tunnel? It's the main road that joins the checkpoint to Zeiss. Passes a long tunnel that passes directly through Caldia Hill. So the checkpoint leads directly into a dungeon. Okay. Wow, an underground road. That'll definitely be a first for me too. Hey, you're back. Thanks for what you did before for bringing me today. Feel free to stop in whenever you have time to spare. Special event for travelers. Need me for anything? Just give me a shout. That's no, okay, dude. We've got everything sorted. Now let's go and see what else is here. Oh, is this the way out? It looks like it is. Oh, wow, this is amazing! Chloe! Don't leave us, Chloe! The waterfall comes from a man named River. I think it's called the Lato Los Lo Lotsi. Water. I can't pronounce that. It was made a very long time ago. Yes, and it's linked directly to the Valeria Lake Shore. Pretty impressive, given that they did it without any orphans to help. So what's that over there? That's the entrance to the tunnel, I think. Yeah. So I guess this is goodbye. Oh. Yes. So you're going to be traveling around the kingdom, right? We might be able to meet again in Grandson. Yes! Really? I'll be going back there when the Queen's birthday celebration starts. So my relatives will be there, so I have to join them. Hell yeah! I hope Shazerazam will, will be there too. And Agate. That's just a month away, isn't it? I think maybe, yeah, we actually may be in Grantsel around that time. Even Grenzel is like literally right next to Zeiss. So then, once you're done with your family stuff, come check the Grenzel Guild branch. If you do, we can try to meet up. I certainly will. Estelle and Joshua, I can't thank you enough. I won't ever forget everything that you've done for me. C come on, don't be so formal. Bring your jet as well for many reasons. I'd say we're pretty even. I want a thing to say. When, when we confronted the mayor, I said some terrible things. 
You care for no one but yourself. But I was no different. Huh? I've been running away from the reality of my own situation for a while now. To the orphanage and to the academy. But the two of you taught me something. You helped me find the courage to hold my head high. And find the strength to protect what matters. Because of you, I know how to be brave. I don't really get it. But if we were to help you, I'm happy. Ah! Oh. <laughs> Cheer up, okay? We'll see each other again in Grantsall! Yes. Absolutely. What? Time to go! What? Ha! I think we'll get to see Sieg there too, right? What? Absolutely! What? No, what a joke. I think grass is pretty far away. I don't think those wings at all. Besides, your home is here. <laughs> Seek isn't just any bird, you know. I think he'll be there. I'm sure. <laughs> Seek just full of surprises, isn't he? Well, then, shall we be off? Yeah. Chloe, Estelle Bright, never forget your sight. Woo-wee! Oh my, Estelle. If anything, I shall miss your rather spirited catchphrases. Ha! Do you hear that, Joshua? She said my catchphrases were spirited. I think she was just being polite. Huh. Shows what you know. Hey, good luck to both of you on your journey. And I'll be praying for you to find your father. <coughs> Thank you. You two take care. Oh my. <coughs> yes, I think so too. We'll see them again. Oh, who's there? Sorry to keep you waiting, Chloe. Oh, Miss Julia! You're done with your duties at last and fortress. Ooh, it's the hot girl! First Lieutenant Schwartz. Oh my god. <laughs> yes! It took longer than I anticipated. Pardon my rudeness, but I've came to get... Come to get your report on the incident. Thank you for your service. <laughs> oh my god, is Chloe like a, a, a military? Hey now, uh, settle down, Sieg. Have you been fulfilling your duty as an escort? Wait, is Chloe actually like a princess or something? <laughs> <laughs> He's always been very helpful. Isn't that right, Sieg? Oh my god, is Chloe like a princess, actually? <laughs> He's certainly chipper. The Arcel is stopped at the end of the highway. You're to report in there. Understood. I'm leaving school for a while. I need to say goodbye to my teachers before returning to Gransel. Oh my god, is she really like a princess or something? Estelle. Joshua. I'll take what you taught me and show that you could show you that I can be strong. Stronger than even you two. I'll do everything in my power to see to that. Dang, what is it? What is up with her? <laughs> Ooh, we have the Professor Layton tunnel here. What's wrong? Nothing. I just got the feeling that someone was. Ew! No, not that guy. Shut up, Estelle. Huh? There's someone here in other in here other than us. Huh? Guess not. Yeah. It's 
Sorry, must have imagined it. Oh, I get it. Ha! I think you still got a little crush on Chloe. Oh God, that would be so cool. I'm, root I'm rooting for them, Chloe and Joshua. Huh? What makes you say that? Oh, don't be shy. You know I can read you like a book. <laughs> it's not unreasonable after all. She's so hot. I mean, uh, yeah, if you were a guy. <laughs> you did, uh, kiss her during the play. What if she asked you to come back? You'd say yes, right? Dang, you are shipping your brother with this guy. The girl, hardcore. <laughs> Jeez. I guess you didn't notice that. You notice what? The last scene. That was just for show, you know. Uh, it was staged, so it would look like a real kiss for the audience. What? Are you kidding me? You deprived me of, of the makeout session? You can be really clueless sometimes. It was written right there in the script notes. Oh, <laughs> I see. Yourself, do not insert foot into mouth. I wonder if you'll relief. Oh, come on, Estelle, don't do this. Uh, Estelle, you okay? <laughs> I'm fine. Come on, come on, say some weights. Uh, I'm gonna say she's probably relieved because, you know, she doesn't want her brother to leave her. In some ways. Do, 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 la, da, do, la, da, do. What is this thing? It takes extra damage from wind. It's a jet tortoise. Okay, it does. Give green as this is a turtle. I'm guessing that, uh... The physical attacks are not gonna do shit against it. Let's just, let's just t test that theory here. Oh, physical attacks work just fine. All right, we're good to go. Oh dang, that is one creepy ass bug. Oh my god, it gives green seven. Not like that matters anymore. <laughs> Going through a tunnel with Joshua and Estrella. Good thing the enemies in here are pretty fucking weak. Okay, any chest? Oh, yes, there is. Tiara bomb. Is empty, like your thieving heart. Estelle doesn't. At the same time, she wants her brother to be happy. It's like she doesn't want him to leave her either. I'm curious, mom. The chest is empty. Cause you removed the contents, you looter. You know what? If they didn't want me to steal it. Why'd they leave it in the middle of nowhere unlocked? You ever think about that game? You ever think about that? Found TR bomb. Nope, still empty. Finally, the one that doesn't insult me. As we go through and this song reminding me of a puzzle.
duped you. Now I see. Okay, let's see. Oh, it does poison attacks. Oh, it hates wind. Let's see how its defenses are. Oh, wow. Well, jeez. The monsters in here are not strong in the least. God. Death blow two. Death blow's revenge. Uh, reduce the searching empty chest. That's really sad. Okay, Sonic the Hedgehog. Fine. Let's go. Ooh, another new monster here. Okay, please, okay. Hypnotic bubbles. <laughs> Fucking hell, Estelle! You are not Joshua! Why are you acting like a. Oh god, Joshua! Did you do that just to make Estelle feel better? Oh god, it's just confusion, but it didn't take hold. Okay. Woo! <laughs> There we go. Oh, hold on, you guys. Sorry, I need to check something. Just one second. Sorry, just just checking something. Okay, there we go. Sorry about that. These monsters are much easier comparatively than the ones we've recently just faced. This reminds me of a puzzle, Luke. Oh, gee, Professor. Well, you sure are smart. Okay, two at once here. Let, let us go. <laughs> Everything here is weak to wind. May as well. May as well try this. Lightning. Unlimited power! Officially a Sith Lord. Let's move out. Joshua. Let's see. Ooh, there's that evil, disgusting looking worm. Joshua, kill it. Kill it. Kill it, radio. Come on. Everything in here is weak to win. Now let's see what we can do. Okay. Do, do. Killing all of these monsters in the cave. Let's see. So weird not having to open anyone's orbman slots. Oh, a healy thing. We barely even need it at all. Jeez.
Let's just make a new save. He's all at arts already. Oh no. No! Please don't confuse Estelle. Oh god, okay. Oh my god! Hey away! Welcome to the stream. Yeah, we're finishing up soon. What the fuck? Oh. We're actually having to fight these monsters here. Oh, it's asleep. I thought because it was bewitching, I thought, uh, I thought it was like a confusion thing. Dead now. Okay. All right, we're good to go. Oh, come on, Joshua. Yeah, seriously, the turtle was definitely metagaming there. Okay, yeah, prepare to use art. Oh, you're just gonna use a physical attack, huh? See how well that works out for you. There we go. That's that dance. Let's move out. Josh, we can finally level up. Lime oh limestone cake. Oh god. Freaking cat jumped on me. God, jeez. Hey, all right. Uh, I've heard this is something we can do. Tear a bomb. This is empty because you've already been here. background. I love this song right here. Ooh, penguins. Demon ass penguins. Look at the dancing. Penguin dance. Penguin dance. And they're not weak to anything. Okay. Let's see how strong they are. Everybody's using art. Okay, they're not very weak to arts at all. Okay, I should use physical attack. Oh, the Diamond Dust Rebellion. Oh god. 
Oh god. Oh no. No, 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 no. No, 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 no. Yep. No, no. Okay, yeah, there's there's a boss, but uh, yeah, no, 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 penguin, more like penguins, ha ha ha. Okay, let's. Uh, I'm just gonna go back to that helio. Oh, it's in another screen, really? There it is. Yes, the pickiest of penguins. Hello, Mirage. I'm just praying that I'm not just on hard copium with the Joshua and Estelle and just. Because I really, really treasure the fucking uh, brother and sister relationship that they have going on. Now that seemed a lot easier to get back than to get to. Like, I think it's so interesting and so unique that what they're doing rather than, you know, like, and it also would be kind of weird, like, I think the weirdest aspect if, if they were thinking, gonna be shipped together is the fact that they both call Cassius dad and they both use the same last name. Like, that to me is what kind of makes it weird, really, like, like, because that seems to solidify them as siblings, and they, they act in a very sibling manner, like, with the teasing and everything, and they lived and grew up in the same house, like, they both call the same dude dad, they both use his last name, and, like, you know, it's all sibling stuff, and I really hope I'm not, like, just hoping this thing, like, because I don't know. I really, really like Joshua and Stella's siblings. I think it's super unique, and I love the dynamic. And I also want them to each find their own love interest. I think that'd be pretty cool. I would want there to be a guy who thinks Estelle is like hot shit, like. She is like the best in his eyes and fuck anyone else who can't see how awesome Estelle is. He thinks Estelle is the greatest in the world. That, that's, that's the kind of guy I think Estelle deserves. Definitely Aeonium. We all need giant Beato in our lives. Absolutely. I really hope that is just, you know, I don't know which way of this is the right way to go. Damn it, which w Oh, that, that was the right way to go! Fuck! God damn it! I've got to hurry! Huh? Someone's coming this way. Who are you? Oh, it's a girl. Oh, hello! You look like an inventor or a pilot or something. Ah, uh, let's see. I used up a lot of my voices. What should I give you? Good afternoon. Where's the fire? Uh, g -g 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 let's see, uh, who should I give you? Uh, maybe Mion. Uh, I'll see if that works. Good afternoon. Um, are you taking this road too? 
Wait, name. I didn't guess any name. Oh, well, yeah. Have you seen any lights that weren't working? The lights along the tunnel wall, I mean. Oh yeah, I'll give her Entrapta. Cause she looks like a freaking um. Cause uh, she looks like she's an inventor. The lights along the tunnel wall, I mean. Huh. So if there are, I haven't noticed any. All the lights we passed were still on. But we did pass one that was flickering. There's two rivers between it and here. That's it! It's just like I thought. Sorry, I have to hurry! Yep, definitely gonna give her entrapped it. I wonder if she's from Zeiss. Strange little kid. She looked the same age. She looked around the same age as you guys. Seemed awfully flustered. Huh. Now I'm kind of worried. Hey, you want to try following her? You read my mind. I don't like the idea of a little girl wandering around here by herself. You have to catch up to her and stick close. Okay, come on, let's hurry. Oh, good. So it looks like we're going down there anyway. The monsters reset. We travel through Professor Layton Tunnel. Found Celestial Ball. Aha! You again! Oh, it's just chests here. Found Tiara Ball. Chest is empty, but you may now fill it with your tears. <laughs> Okay. Trying to find where she went. Hopefully she didn't go into the limestone cave. Where the fuck did she go? I think they said it was beyond the bridge, yeah, so let's uh Make sure to get everything healed up. She looks like she could be a party member. And I'd love to have been trapped all along. So, that'd be awesome. Let's see. Yep, she's here. Good, and I saved at a good point, too. Huh. I can't believe there are so many of them. It's gonna break at this rate. And maybe this. Bearing set. Angle of elevation. 20 degrees. Level compression at 30%. Yet yeah, you are totally entrapped. Us. Go! If you come any closer, then I won't miss next time. I mean it. Oh, looks like my calculations weren't correct. Huh. Oops, I think that might have made them angrier. Ah! Hiya! Estelle Bright, save her right! Uh, not that bad. Huh? Hey, I remember you. We can talk later. Get back. We've got to get rid of these things first. Yes, praise the lamp. Ooh, lamp. God, even know they're all gonna move out. Oh my god, she's already in the party! <laughs> wow! Wow! She's already in the party! Oh, kick ass! Look at this! Oh, well, well, let's see what I can do. Oh, wow, looks like she's a... Uh, a rock elemental.
Let's rock, rock on! Time for some Hellgate London! Here we all strike! There we go. Stone impact! God damn it, she didn't get the kill. Uh, That's that then. Let's move out. Oh, she's actually a little bit weaker than us. was a goner for sure. <laughs> and well, the important thing is that you're safe. But you really should be more careful. Scaring up monsters is a surefire way to get yourself eaten. Uh, but if I left them alone, they probably would have broken that light. Speaking of which, all of those things go after the lights anyway. Oh my god, we got our party member right away instead of waiting for like five fucking hours. Like with Chloe. Don't they do the same thing when the highway lights are switched out? The septium in those circuits is the monster's favorite food. The highway lights work to keep monsters away. But when they stop working, they have the opposite effect. Ah, I get it. Still, you shouldn't mess with stuff like that. Septium might be their favorite food. A little girl's probably right in close second. Oh, sorry. Go easy there. Giving your nightmares and saying don't do that isn't exactly going to score you any points. I don't need such a wet blanket. Anyway, my name's Estelle. And I'm Joshua. We're bracers affiliated with the guild. Oh, so that's why you're so tough. I'm Tina. I work as an apprentice at the Central Factory. Well, that's pretty impressive. And she is an inventor. Well done, Tina. We're heading to Zeiss. So do you want to join us the rest of the way? My God! Jesus Christ! <laughs> this is like after freaking Luffy spent like freaking three years trying to recruit Nico Robin. And then he, and then like he recruits Brooke in like freaking two seconds. <laughs> After meeting him. <laughs> oh my god! Reading to Zeiss, do you want to join us the rest of the way? That's right. You want to be around if monsters show up again. Really? Thank you! Would you mind waiting for a little bit? I gotta go get that light fixed. Yeah, it's probably risky to leave it like that. How in the world did you know it had burned out, though? Well, I was lucky enough to notice a problem when I was looking in the computer database. It seemed like a defective unit was installed here by mistake. Alright, all right. it's a good thing you caught it when you did. Computer? Database? And they still don't have TV! <laughs> But computers seem to be a brand new thing here. How the fuck did this world invent computers before they invented TV? Jeez. Huh. Okay, that should do it. Sorry it took so long. Wow, color me impressed. Well, if she's an apprentice in the central factory, she has to be good. <laughs> <laughs> well, I didn't do anything special. I just fixed the quartz connection and dusted the orbital pressure. Huh? Well, it sure sounds special. Now I'm uh, now wondering, can I ship Joshua with her? Jeez. It's not that big a deal. 
Uh, okay, how to explain this? Heat trap has a quartz circuit inside, and that and probably connected the orbital energy inside the unit will have nowhere to go. As a result, the orbital won't be able to function properly. This happens sometimes with highway lights, which means their ability to give out light and ward off monsters is compromised, so STOP! Uh, maybe you should say the explanation for after we got the road. Wow. I had her pegged. Oh, wow. <laughs> oh, wow, jeez. I love you already. Dang. A lot of the way because you remind me of the character that I'm basing uh, this voice of uh, on for you. Dang. She's 10? What? Jeez. Uh, oh, and I had no idea. Jeez. Oh, wow. Then, yeah, no, don't shiver with Joshua. Maybe you should save the explanation for after we get on the road. I mean, if we stand around too long, the monsters, you know. Yeah, I guess so. I was swarming up, too. Whew. Oh, she's 12. Oh my god, I didn't realize she was that young. She looks like she's the same age as Estelle from the portrait. Alright, thanks for telling me. <laughs> well, why don't we set up for Zeiss then? Okay. Yes, sir! Alright, let's check her out in the, uh... Yeah, she, does. she looks a bit shorter. I wouldn't say she looks like a child, though. But, uh... Like, she looks the same age as Chloe. Let's give her better equipment. Alright, we can at least give her some uh, accessories. See what the guide is telling me to do right now. Oh, just go to. <sniffs> just head to Zeiss, and I think uh, once we get actually to Zeiss, we're gonna we're gonna stay, save there. Zeiss just reminds me of Dimes. He's Zeiss versus Airlet. Here we go. Oh! He's Zeiss like an underground. Oh no, there's like an elevator probably. The tunnel ends here. So does that mean. Is this the entrance to Zeiss? That's right! That leads right to the basement of the central factory. I'm excited to see it! Central Factory is a pride and joy of Zeiss. It says it's an industrial city. I heard it was big, but that's all about I really know. Well, yeah. It's really huge. Anyone who's not used to the layout can get lost in a hurry. <sighs> that's a creepy thought. I'm getting to worry whether or not we'll really be able to make it to the guild. The way out of the city is up on the first floor. Well, she gotta get there. Thank you! Well, let's go in. Uh, hold on. Hold your horses, Josh. I'm going to check this area out first. There's a dude here. <laughs> He's been walking into this barrel for the past five hours. <laughs> Hilarious, Aeonia. Okay, that makes eight cans. Check and double check. 
Take it on the factory. Ooh, some smooth jazz to the size of the left elevator, right basement organ workshop. Whoa. What's this place? Wow. Looks almost like the entire factory is completely automated. <laughs> Let's see. There are lots of Mormon factories. They make everything from lights to airship parts. Awesome! A little overwhelming, but awesome! Oh, there's only an emergency staircase through that door. If you want to go to the ground floor, just go back the way you came in street down the hall. You're heading the job, girl. Ooh, it looks like you'll have a side quest later. And I can't change the camera here. elevator. You can take us from the basement to the roof. Huh. Guess I've never seen one of those outside the mines. This one seems super high tech. <laughs> well, this is Zeiss. And since this is a central factory, I'm sure they have quite a few of these. They have more than one? Ha <laughs> ha! It's the latest model, too. Maximum weight capacity? 50 Torin. You can even handle heavy industrial equipment with no problem. I don't entirely get it. But it sure sounds impressive. So, how do we get it to move? Oh, you just pick which floor you want on that panel. Let's see. You want to go into the city, right? Yeah, can you take us up to the first floor? Okay! Factory's main floor. This is where the reception desk and consumer maintenance windows are. I see. So we can get out of town from here. Oh, Tina! Miss Hazel! There you are. The Supervisor Travis have been looking for you. I'd like you to go straight up to the operations room. Oh, okay, I will. Uh oh, sounds urgent. Thank you for showing us around. Ah, it's no big deal. It's the least I can do to have you beat up those monsters for me. Well, we're planning to be in Zeiss for a little while. Would you mind if we stop by to see you again? Hi. I'd love that. Bye-bye, then. Did you off to work on more machines. <laughs> what a sweet kid. I get the impression that she's a lot tougher than she looks. I agree. I always want a sweet, lovable little sister like her. Instead of, might I add, an obnoxious little brother. Okay, thank you. Thank you for that, Estelle. Thank you. Okay, I was thinking about that for a while. Like, what the f- Okay, okay, she definitely thinks of Joshua. And I always thought that Estelle saw herself as the older sister. Here we go. Okay, thank you, Estelle, for putting my fears to rest. Keep saying things like that, but you're the one who's always following me around. What are you more like a real older sister? You need to get your head out of the clouds every now and then. <laughs> Look who's talking! Anyway, all sibling rivalry. Yeah, sibling. Here we go. Thank you, Estelle. Okay. Rivalries aside, what end of the city? Yeah. First, I'd like to switch assignments to the guild. 
Plus, we can see if there's any new information on the orbit or death. Sounds like a plan. Whew! Okay. Thank you for that, Estelle and Joshua. My shipping brain tends to work over overdrive sometimes, so she was nervous about the kiss, you know, she goes, I think a big part of her doesn't want her to lose her little brother to, to someone else, because, you know, that's the thing that, it's like, younger, like, some siblings tend to do. Welcome to maintenance. It may seem just like a service window, but we're full part of the factory dormant division as full equipped as any shop. He's free to make a full, you full use of our facilities. Oh. Nope, everybody's slots are open. Oh, HP 3. We don't have nearly enough uh, seven for that. Definitely make a confused one, man. Dang, everything requires so much green seven. this building before we go. Oh, I think this is just where we were. Alright. Oh, this... Oh, okay. You know what? Uh, we're probably gonna come back here sometime. Uh, let's... Let's go into the city. Once we get uh, in front of the guild, say... Cause I, I'll, I think I want to start. Yeah, I'll start next time with exploring Zeiss. Okay, you guys. Whew, thank you so much, Estella Joshua, for that bit of relief right there. Cause I was, I was legitimately worried for a second about like, you know. But no, no, no. They're definitely calling each other siblings. And like, okay. Oh, jeez. Okay, I was worried about that. You guys, this game is amazing! And next time, we're gonna explore the city of Zeiss. I'm surprised that we're in the city of I see. This, this whole part of the map is underground. I did not expect that, because the yeah, limestone cave is right there. And we have the fortress with the military girl. She's gonna be there. And we have the tower. Another fort. And we have Elmo! I wonder what Elmo is. Probably a town here. But, uh, yeah. See, we got a lot of places in uh, this neck of the woods to visit. Whole fuck ton of dungeons. Probably the biggest place in the whole map is uh, Zeiss. Even though Bose is a bigger region, it's like there's less places to go. Doesn't even look like we're gonna visit the uh, Calvert uh, border here, border station. Okay, so until next time, I will say. Oh yeah, and also uh, Tuesday. Uh, wait, yeah, Tuesday more uh, root devil. So until next time, I will say. So long, farewell. I will to say good night. You're all the sweetest of hearts. See ya.